Hello everyone, welcome to the channel, Rad here from Radko Tarot and this is going to be Gemini Sun, Gemini Moon and Gemini Rising weekly tarot reading June 11 to June 17, 2018 so let's see what we got for the Gemini the first card marking up the topic of the week is going to be the Ten of Swords second card which points up the core of the situation this is going to be the Seven of Swords then we do have the challenges that you need to overcome that is going to be the Knight of Pentacles and last but not least we do have the Guidance card which is the Page of Swords so for what it seems you Gemini's are going to abandon somebody or rather like this is like a cooperation that no longer serves in your favor and that being said you are, you are about to start cutting ties with that person this is that person you are going to start cutting ties Either a, uh, a suitor or a co-worker, business partner or a boss or in, in, in general as a job, it does look like that their agenda no longer serves your agenda, you know, or kind of like you will find out that the more cooperation you do with them, the more you attend to their problems rather than to your problems. They are more beneficial than you are more beneficial. Or in other words, uh, all the compassions behind the actions are entirely up for them. In other words, you know, you are doing their dirty work. All right, and that will force you here with the Ten of Swords to make some irrevocable decision, decisions during that particular week. Either to break up with your girlfriend or your boyfriend, or to slam on the table and make your new rules, <coughs> you know, or place the ultimatums you require, and also some uh, irreversible actions from your, from your behalf. It is because you will realize that this is already the rock bottom and actually nothing can get, can get worse into that particular situation you're finding yourself at uh, because this person either they can improve your circumstances or they can just go away because even without them you are going to find yourself in a much better place so that being said you have that huge impulse you know to actually start dictating the rules of the game and if they don't want to follow then they are free to leave you know the door doesn't have a lock and everybody is free to come in see what it is going on with your life and if they want to take a positive part in it then they are welcome to stay if they don't then they can uh, freely walk away very important here is uh, with the seven of swords not to be afraid to raise your voice and really to um, show or kind of like uh, yeah show your demands or uh, what was the English word here it's not demands it's more like um, conditions you know to display your conditions of uh, under what kind of a conditions you are, are willing to cooperate with this person now you should not be fooled though because they very well know what they what they want to achieve you know from all this and unfortunately you have found yourself being a tool in their hands for accomplishing their own personal as I said agenda and it is time to uncover that because with the seven of swords which is the core card here or the root of the matter you are going to realize that you are leading a war or leading a battle that it is not your battles battle to win all right and if you are about to lead it you do deserve a a substantial comp co um, compensation for it all right so do not be afraid to storm the situation to raise your voice and to stand up for once right um, here with the page of swords it is displayed exactly that and this is the conjunction in between the couple of cards you know uh, that you you don't necessarily need to leave it okay but you need to rearrange the rules there you need to demand for a compensation um, that you want to follow up uh, that uh, if they want you to follow up that particular uh, code of conduit they ask you to. The page of swords points that you need to display that you are an orig original thinker, an independent per uh, an undependable person and you are someone that they cannot toy around. The page of swords is also about spring cleaning so you got to um, really talk about with this person or talk over with this person those things into the uh, into the common cooperation with them that seriously bothers you and until this very moment you actually um, 
kind of like try to not pay attention to them and I give an impression that they can just go by you you know but at this very moment they have been so unbearable that you cannot stand them anymore and probably this is what is going to force your outbreak or rather like your um, <clears throat> stand for once right and it does look like that the things severely is go are going to improve for you after you actually go through that very um, small in extent of time but in the same time very dynamic you know um, cycle of uh, getting to um, or kind of like displaying to this person where they stand and where are you stand so basically uh, this week for you is going to be about uh, rearranging positions with a particular person either in your romantic life or either into your career plan that they have seriously overstepped your comfort zone that being said, this was your weekly tarot reading Gemini's for June 11 to June 17, 2018. I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it. And in case you're interested in a private reading with me, everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video. Rod signing out now. See you next time. Bye.